happy Wednesday and welcome to a new vlog. We are headed to work and school and yeah, this week is moving right along. I'm not mad at it. It's already Wednesday. My husband's 30th birthday is tomorrow. So we're going to be uh, prepping for the rest of this week for that. I'm just going to do like a, a little celebration at home, just the three of us. And we will more than likely, he has to work this weekend, so we will more than likely probably just do dinner or something, maybe tomorrow night or Friday night, um, because I get off a little bit earlier, so I can kind of go home and prep and whatnot. But yes, I am so blessed to have him. We are so blessed to have him as husband and father, and we just love him dearly. So um, I've got him some gifts. Um, I'm going to decorate the house. So yeah, that's that. Um, but yes, yeah, so this weekend, I don't really have any plans, y'all, and I'm so excited about it. There's some stuff that I want to watch on Netflix um, that people have been recommending, so we're going to watch that. Um, I'm, I'm going to go through my clothes. My husband already brought everything in from storage, so I'm going to kind of go through and separate like all of my fall, winter, spring, summer stuff and get that together, kind of throw away stuff that I'm not going to wear anymore. And that's really it. I'm just going to be chilling, y'all. So, I am we may get some footage. We may not. My plan is to not spend any money this weekend. So, I'm probably going to try to stay in the house. I do want to go grocery shopping probably. Just get a few things. Nothing major. But other than that, y'all, that's that. Um, oh, and I thought about it. I never gave y'all the update from my doctor's visit. I don't know. I thought I recorded, but I didn't. But pretty much, long story short, so in one of my previous vlogs, y'all saw that I was at the orthopedic doctor for a doctor's appointment. So, had an MRI. This was my second MRI on, um, but they did both knees. This was my second um, MRI. And basically, y'all, long story short, um, didn't get the best report. I kind of already knew it, so it wasn't too hard on me. But my knee, my right knee is completely done. There's no more cartilage in it. There's nothing. Arthritis has completely taken over. Um, so we're just kind of bone to bone at this point. Um, and he told me at some point in my life, I will have to get a total knee replacement. Now, like I said, granted, I already knew this, but just hearing that as a 29 year old woman with so much more life to live, that was very heartbreaking. And, um, cause he was like, my knee looks worse than some of his older patients. And it just kind of, I don't know, but it is what it is y'all. You know, I didn't let it get me down. Um, I still thank God have mobility in it as you know, um, with the help of medication. So, um, it is what it is y'all. We're not worried about that right now. I just kind of wanted to update y'all cause I know I kind of just said I was at the doctor. Bye. But yeah, that's what's going on with my knee. So he gave me a steroid shot. He said that should kind of give me comfort for six months, um, at most. And then I'll probably have to just get those on routine um and just to continue to take like anti-inflammatory medication to kind of help with the pain but yeah y'all that's that's what it is um i'm gonna probably just try to start getting more active and kind of getting moving it because i know the more i don't move it the more i'm gonna lose it so i'm gonna definitely try to start back move even if it's just like a quick 30 minute walk i'll try that um because honestly there's probably no rehabilitation for it because it's too far gone um but i can only just do my part and just try to you know move around a little bit more and you know so i can get mobility because y'all it's rough it is really rough like i'm a tough cookie and for me to even go to the doctor because i was in pain like on a scale of one to ten it's a 30 so i had to see what was going on but that's that y'all y'all don't worry about me um, I'm going to be good. We still going to be cute. But yeah, that's. I just wanted to kind of update y'all and let y'all know what was going on with that. But I will catch y'all in the next clip. And have the most amazing day. Bye, y'all. Y'all see my girl hair? Please just disregard her shirt, baby. She, whatever lunch was, was served, she, she enjoyed it. Um, but y'all see my girl hair? Mama did the knot list. Don't play with it. What is that, Braylon? Cute. You tell the vlog hi. Not today. Okay. Mm. She just woke up. <laughs> Y'all know what to say. Don't be with my party. Um, 
on a budget because he gonna break it. Like, look at these cups. $6.99. And they got the smaller ones for $4.99. Cast iron cups. This little Aldi vines, um, the aisles like change periodically, so I enjoy coming here. And you just never know what you're gonna find. What you say, Brian? You want something? those dispensers wine chiller like yeah 10 piece food storage hmm. i wonder this has a whole rotisserie chicken in it i'm not buy this Okay, so on to what I came in here for. <laughs> I am cooking dinner tonight. So we're cooking dinner. I'm gonna do cabbage, um, barbecue, baked pork chop, cornbread, and mac and cheese. Some elbow noodles. I have pork chops at home already. They are already thawing out. Um, so we don't have to worry about that. I know we needed some garlic powder. I'm gonna get two onion powder because I feel like we run out of that more than a little bit. Um, don't really think we need anything else. I'm gonna get some of this lips and onion soup because I love to put that on my meats when I bake. And it's only 89 cents. And I think you get three packs, two packs. So it's still pretty good. Um, I think I'm gonna grab some cream of mushroom. That was loud, right, baby? That was loud. Um, I'm not really trying to do a whole lot of grocery shopping here, but I do want to get the things that I know we need, especially for dinner tonight. I think, I think that's it. I'm going to go check out this frozen section, and then we're going to leave. having the fines. I don't think there's nothing that I want. Let me get some butter. It's actually on sale. That's pretty good. Um, and y'all, I really think that's all we need. I am so tired, but we gotta eat. Um, yeah, I'm gonna grab a sour cream. just in case, because I feel like ours is probably old. Um, yeah, I really think that's it. 
And I don't have y'all on no kind of tripod, so y'all probably bouncing all over the place. I'm so sorry. <laughs> um, I need some more cold brew, so I'm gonna get some of that. I prefer Stokes, but the Starbucks is only a few cents cheaper, I mean more, so I'm gonna get that one. So we got everything we need plus some. Oh, you know what? I think we probably want to need some barbecue sauce. So I should probably get that. Do you see them, Brave? <gasps> oh my goodness. <laughs> Say go home. You tell them go home. <laughs> All right, y'all. So here is dinner. I did not vlog the cooking process because it just didn't happen. <laughs> Um, but we got honey butter cornbread. I already had milk piece, y'all. It's so good. So, so good. Um, we got oven baked barbecue pork chops. We got some cabbage. Smelling so good. Still steaming. And then we got some mac and cheese, y'all. Don't nobody make mac and cheese like me. But, um, at this point, I'm full, kind of tipsy. I came home and made us a Zachary because today was bananas for me um but yeah i may or may not even eat y'all i'm just tired at this point so it may, might just be lunch tomorrow but i just want to show y'all dinner and i'll see y'all tomorrow what's up guys happy thursday today is my husband's birthday he turned the big 3-0 today and i am just so excited i am so happy um he is so blessed and just really watching him trans transform into the man that he is today, the husband, the father, um, he's just everything. He's everything. And I am so blessed to be his co-pilot in life and to just be on his by his side. Just you know, I am just I don't know. It just it just does something to me. We got together in our teens, okay? We were seniors in high school um when we got together so we have spent our entire 20s together late teens together um we did senior year of high school together we did college together we did adult you know young adulthood together and now here we are you know he's 30 i'm almost 30 we're married we have a child now and it's just y'all it's surreal it is really surreal and it's just a blessing and I don't know I'm getting emotional thinking about it can you imagine like spending that much time with a person and still just life is just still good genuinely you know what I'm saying so I am um 
make sure y'all tell him happy birthday in the comments um but baby when you watch this because i know you're gonna watch because you are my biggest supporter um i love you so much happy birthday um i wish you many 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 more i can't wait till we grow all together and we babysit our grandkids um and yes and we just get to tell them about the love story that we have created um but yes i love you so much and i hope that your 30s and this next chapter of life is bomb um so yeah i am headed home him and braylon are already at home and y'all listen i on the way to daycare drop off i was thinking i was like oh i need to get her teacher to help her create a card for him and the teacher she was game she was like oh yes we can do it we can do it um she was like it's early um she's like the only one in the room right now i can go ahead and get started now and she was like um i got you and i was like thank you and um he sent me a picture um of what they made and y'all it's so cute it's so so cute so i'm happy that i thought about that that was like a cute little touch because we love her artwork we have like this special folder our fridge is covered in her artwork we love it so i'm glad i thought about that um because that's just that's just a cute little touch but yeah we're not really doing anything yesterday we're probably for sure going to be eating leftovers today um uh, because it's already almost six o'clock it's late but tomorrow I get off earlier than him. So I am going to actually set up the house. I'm gonna do a little decoration. Uh, we're gonna go out to eat tomorrow with friends. And yeah, that's 30. We, um, I was really bummed as I told y'all in, in like a previous vlog that we didn't really have a vacation plan. You know, because truthfully y'all, we both have our passports. We've had them for some years now. I think we got our passports probably in 2021, but it was like right when COVID was like crazy. Everything was shut down, life was crazy. So we haven't even got a chance to use our passports. Um, so I was hoping that we could have been somewhere tropical on somebody's resort or island, but it just didn't happen. But baby, he gonna be 30 all year. So we gonna we can make it happen. We can make it happen. Um, so yeah, for now, we're just gonna kind of keep it chill and, you know, just celebrate being alive and having each other. Um, and I think that's all right with me. But, um, but yes, make sure you guys tell my husband happy birthday. Y'all say hey to the birthday boy. How does it feel to be 30? Does it hurt? Achy. Dang. So I gotta look forward to it hurting in October. Yeah. Sheesh. But we about to ride around and collect and gather some of his freebies. Baby back there in the back. Say hey. She chilling. It's pouring down raining, so we about to make this quick. But yeah. racking them up y'all so he got his free sub from jersey mike and then now he just got his starbucks um trying to see what i'm gonna eat what i'm gonna get what you what you gonna get for me dinner at home <laughs> morning y'all and happy friday so we are headed to work um it's a short day so we're happy about that and i'm just ready for the weekend i don't know about y'all but i'm not doing nothing this weekend as y'all can tell by the vlogs every weekend has been something it's been giving very much busy and i need some rest and relaxation um so yeah, I ain't doing nothing. I need to do some stuff around my house. Like I need to like reorganize my bathroom. 
I need to like go through my clothes and get those organized. Just get my life together at home. So yeah, we ain't doing nothing. So if you up for a do nothing vlog, then let's let's get it. Um, because that's that's what we're gonna be on. I always get the ham and Swiss croissant from Starbucks because it is so good. My best friend put me on when I was pregnant with Braylon and I just been hooked ever since. And I even tried to make them. I even tried to make them at home to just try to save money just to see if I can like recreate. And I was like, uh, -uh. it wasn't bad, but it wasn't this. So yeah, I will catch y'all later. Today is the day that I decorate the house for Brian's birthday that we're gonna actually celebrate for him today. And we're still trying to figure out where we're gonna go eat at tonight. Never knew it had to be this hard, but we're still trying to figure that out. So I guess y'all will see when y'all, <laughs> y'all gonna find out when we find out cause we don't know. But um, yeah, I will see y'all later today. Um, Braylon, me and Braylon gonna go around and just go get some stuff um, for the house for our daddy's birthday and then that's yeah that's really it okay guys so this is what we came up with and i'm having to whisper because braylon is asleep um oh my gosh y'all i just realized my three is upside down we're not changing it what the fuck <laughs> oh my gosh okay so we got balloons um we have a cake it says happy 30th birthday um, and I got this cake topper off of Amazon. It says, holy shit, you're 30. Um, and these are his gifts. So he loves these Hey Dude shoes. Um, they look nice on him. I don't like them, but he loves them. So I always buy him a pair. Um, he has this super nice Patriots, um, bomber jacket. So when he opens it, I'll show y'all what that looks like. Cause it's super nice. And then he has this, um, <laughs> car says baby daddy but he has his basket and i'll try to show y'all what all is in it so his car has cash and then he has this shot glass that says dirty 30 has this um nice i ordered it from this um seller but it says i'm trying not to miss it in. it says happy 30th birthday and then it kind of has the meaning behind the beats and all that kind of stuff um has some gift cards for some of the places that I know he likes um and this really nice cutting board so yeah and I did also buy him the um Dior no the YSL Y cologne because I knew he was running out but I already gave it to him um a couple of weeks ago because he was out but yeah so I'm excited he should be home probably in the next five or six minutes i'm gonna try to get his reaction my house is a hot mess right now because we're in the process of reorganizing and cleaning so i don't know how much i'm gonna show y'all but yes um and i got some balloons as well but yay happy 30th birthday baby again we love you so much thank you for every sacrifice that you make for us thank you for always being here for us thank you for being our provider protector our personal superman we love you so 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 much and i hope 30 is absolutely amazing for you and i cannot believe my balloon is upside down that's gonna bother me but I'm not changing it, y'all. I call hell getting these balloons to stick to this counter. So we're not changing it. It's just going to be something we're going to laugh about. And we're going to move on. But yes. See y'all in a little bit. Oh, we're also going to go. Um, I kept asking him, like, baby, where do you want to go for dinner? I want to take you. We're going to go to dinner. I'm going to take you to dinner. Where do you want to go? We've been talking about this for like a week now. Um, and a lot of places we did want to go, we were like, is it really Braylon friendly? Um, probably not. So he ended up saying Texas Roadhouse. And that's my favorite. So I wasn't about to give any rebuttal on that. Um, so yeah, we're going to go to Texas Roadhouse for dinner. Just something simple, y'all. Really nothing major. Um, but yes, yeah, so I will see y'all in a little bit. And again, I hopefully will be able to get his reaction. But I just want to show y'all what I did. Bye. Okay. Okay. <laughs> My girl loves Texas Roadhouse bread. Is it yummy, Braylon? Is it yummy? Texas Roadhouse. We got the best stuff.